Welcome to our video on coding best practices. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers ponder but often overlook, how to properly comment your code. Our viewer is curious about which comments belong in header and source files and how to effectively communicate through comments in different programming languages. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now let's continue on. Let's discuss how to properly comment your code. First, we'll look at the main function. It's important to keep comments concise and focused. In the header files, comments should provide documentation about the functions. This includes details like the function's purpose, parameters, and return values. When it comes to the source files, comments should explain the logic within the function. This includes describing loops, conditions, and any complex logic. Now consider whether to repeat header comments in the source file. It's generally a good practice to keep documentation consistent across both. In summary, aim for clarity and consistency in your comments. This will help others understand your code better and maintain it more easily. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The best practice for commenting is to avoid them when possible. Instead, focus on making your code self-documenting. Use clear and descriptive names for types, functions, and variables. Keep functions small and simple. Choose file names that clearly indicate the purpose of the code. Use comments only when necessary to explain non-obvious aspects. Explain why the code does something rather than how it works. Document preconditions and postconditions in comments. Avoid using comments for version history, use version control systems instead. Strive to write clear, understandable code. If code becomes complex, comments may be necessary, but be cautious of outdated comments. Aim for clarity in your code. And that's it. I hope that helped find the resolution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.